Good day my fellow royal fans and welcome back to another installment. Today's top story, Prince Harry, Meghan Markle's move to LA, insult to Queen Elizabeth, an act of selfishness. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's decision to suddenly move to Los Angeles after staying in Canada for a few months was an insult to Queen Elizabeth. British politician Nigel Farage also called the royal couple's move an act of selfishness, especially since the Sussexes took a private jet from Vancouver Island to LA right before the border was closed. They've decided that actually they're not going to live out on the west coast of Canada, they never were. Were they? They're off to Hollywood and she's got a contract coming up shortly with Disney, he told LBC. Farage also talked about the POTUS recent tweet that drew a slew of mixed reactions from Americans and royal fans. Donald Trump thinks that to leave the UK as they've done as the Prime Minister calls a national emergency, as Harry's own father has been diagnosed as an over 70 with COVID-19, Trump thinks that's an insult to the Queen and an act of selfishness. He said the Americans will not pay their security bill and nor should they, he claimed. On Twitter, Trump stressed the fact that he will not be paying for Prince Harry and Markle's security costs since they are no longer officially members of the royal family. But during the Duchess of Sussex's trip to the US for her baby shower, the poster shoulder part of her security fees. I am a great friend and admirer of the Queen and the United Kingdom. It was reported that Harry and Meghan, who left the kingdom, would reside permanently in Canada. Now they have left Canada for the US. However, the US will not pay for their security protection. They must pay, he wrote. Some people were not impressed to see Trump's tweet during the coronavirus pandemic. How is this relevant right now? I don't remember. Harry and Meghan asking the US to pay for their protection. I guess someone's still mad he wasn't invited to the royal wedding, Twitter user said. You tell them, Mr. President, we are all in agreement. Yeah, I agree too. Guys, thank you for watching. Great stuff as usual. If you enjoyed that video, hit that like button, leave us a comment, and please, if you haven't done it already, don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you next time. Goodbye for now.